Hello my viewers. In this video I want to compare the quality of both the fiber type of air filter which is like this right here where uh, if you can see you can, you can actually see right through the filter. See how you can see the light right through it? So you're going to have some particles definitely going through it. Whereas the pleated type of air filter, okay, uh, you know, you might see some light going through it, but not like you do on the, uh, the fiber type. Now, what I want to show you, what I'm going to do here, is I want to put both these filters together. So, I'm going to put this filter in, in front of the pleated filter in an experiment where some of the smaller particles will pass through this fiber type of filter and the pleated filter will catch the smaller particles. So let's try that. I'll so first of all, uh, I'll put my pleated filter, pleated one inch filter in here. Okay. And then on top of it, I'm going to put the fiber type and uh, we'll see how this works out over say a period of about oh, one week. See you in a week. And I'm back uh, five weeks later instead of one week. So let's take a look at these filters and see what you think. Okay, well, now I'm taking out the uh, fiber filter, which is pretty much just a rock collector, and the pleated filter. Now let's see. What we have here. Right after five weeks, the good old rock collector here, which is the fibered uh, filter, has collected quite a bit of dust on it. You see, here's the back side. So, the back side, of course, is cleaner than the front side that's collecting dirt, dust, rocks, whatever. And then here is the pleated filter, which caught more debris. Probably tell the difference here. That's the back side. And this is the side that was collecting dust. So the fibered filter is collecting the large particles and the pleat was collecting the finer particles. So you see there is a big difference in these filters. Uh, really so I mean for the most part the pleated filter does give you the most bang for the buck 